Well, good morning, everyone. Everyone who's watching from all the quarters of the universe. You can see that this morning we are in a different space. We don't usually have our class from outer space. But today's the day because today is a very special church holiday. It's Ascension. And what happens on Ascension? Things go up. Why are we having Sunday school in space? Why? Why are we not making something out of sugar and eating it? We're doing something today. We're actually not cooking. We are making something that goes up. Ascension is when we celebrate Jesus's going up to heaven. Ascension. In celebration, we are gonna launch things into the air, uh, into the vacuum, I mean, of space. So what is Ascension anyway? Ascension is the day that we celebrate this story. I'm sure you remember that Jesus came to earth to save us from our sins. And that's why he went to go die for us on the cross. But three days later, he came bursting out of the tomb because he had conquered sin and death. After that time, Jesus made many appearances on earth to show everyone that he was resurrected, but he couldn't stay here forever. He had to go back to heaven so he could send us the Holy Spirit. So he gathered all his friends together outside Bethany, and he lifted up his hands and blessed everyone. And as he blessed everyone, he was lifted up to heaven, and a cloud eventually took him from their sight. The word ascend means to go up. And so when we celebrate ascension, we're celebrating Jesus's going up to heaven. In order to celebrate Jesus's ascension up into heaven, we're gonna cause things to ascend ourselves right here in outer space where it's cozy. For this project, the most important thing you need is not a pair of scissors, but a grown-up because we're going to be setting something on fire and if you do that without your parents around you are going to be in big trouble so make sure you have a grown-up with you don't count me you will actually need scissors we're going to send these innocent looking tea bags flying so what's important about the tea oh great how did this even happen that is against the rules of physics but we are in space so maybe that's why oh oh separated like the goats from the sheep so the tea i have chosen has one of these little stringy things on it that's actually important because otherwise this thing won't work how do i know <laughs> because i tried to do it with the other kind of tea bag and it was a big failure because it's the wrong shape so Make sure you get tea that has like a string and a thing on it. Uh, I chose this gross tea that I don't like and will never drink. I also have this paper towel here to help clean up whatever mess is going to be created. And the exciting part, a source of flame. What are we doing with all this? We're burning some tea? Oh no, my friends. We are making tea bag rockets. As Jesus left this earth to go to heaven, so this tea bag will ascend from the kitchen table to great heights. And then something's gonna happen afterwards and I'll show you. Okay, so what you need to do, it's so easy. Like I said, make sure you have that grown up though, very important part. You take your tea bag and cut this part off, the top part, see, like that. See, like that. And then you take the gross tea that you don't like and pour it out onto this paper towel. And what does that leave you with? <laughs> a tube. You want to make sure you take at least one end of the tube and make the cut really straight like that. And then push these things out of the way and get ready to marble. Open up your tube like that, then set it at an appropriate space on your table. And then tea bag, prepare thyself for glory. And set that thing on fire. And in a moment it will That was fun, let's do it again. Fire. But what all 
also happens is, look, it comes back down. Because after Ascension comes Pentecost, which is next week, and that's where the Holy Spirit comes down from heaven to earth and stays so far for the next couple of thousand years. Jesus went up to heaven and the Holy Spirit came down. I hope you had as much fun as I did setting fire to these teabag rockets. It's always good to shoot things up into the air in a church service. Do you think that Jesus would have thought ascension was fun? Looks pretty fun. Like, how could you go wrong? Plus, he was going to be with God in heaven forever. What is gonna be more fun than that? Answer nothing. Oh, thank you for joining me here on Ascension as we celebrate Jesus' rising from the earth up to heaven. And I hope that you can come and join me next week. But until then, stay well, be blessed.